Hello everyone, I am Ron and in this video, I am going to talk about the theory of nationalism, animated, maybe. But first, what is nationalism? Nationalism is a set of political, social, and economic systems characterized by the promotion of one nation's interest with the goal of achieving and maintaining self-governance or total sovereignty. It holds that a special nation should govern itself and be free of external interference. It aims to foster and sustain a sense of national identity based on shared characteristics such as culture, language, race, and religion. It aims to preserve and reshape a country's culture. The concept of nationalism is essentially modern having emerged in the late 18th century. The political awakening of the lower classes was linked to the conceptualization of nationalism in a distinctively modern sense. Nationalist movements have always been populist in nature, seeking to integrate the lower classes into political life. The five basic elements of nationalism Culture, religion, territory, language, and history are the five basic elements of nationalism. First is culture is a set of shared beliefs and a way of life that brings people together. Next is religion, where it helps unite people in a specific area. Third is territory, in which a common land provides people with a sense of unity. Fourth is language which is a key component of nationalism in a common one. And finally, history is a common thread that binds people together. We will learn about or understand nationalism if we first consider the word nation. A nation is a large group of people who share a common ancestry, history, culture, or language and live in a specific country or territory. According to Benedict Anderson, a nation is an imagined community and imagined as both inherently limited and sovereign. So according to him, it is imagined because even the smallest nation exists what a simple person can know. For example, one cannot know every person in the nation, just as one cannot know every aspect of its economy, geography, history, and so on and so forth. Results, Works, and Nationalism Anderson claims that Nolami Tangere evoked an imagined community because readers and the author were familiar with and intimate with each other, with the characters and readers situated in the same temporal and spatial context. It also provided a means of representing the nation as an imagined community that operated on empty time, allowing the reader to be omniscient and see a limited society and the key person in it. The founding texts of Philippine nationalism were Nolomi Tangere and El Filibusterismo. By presenting a narrative that contextualizes the country in terms of politics, economy, and culture, these novels expose the ills of the Spanish colonial government and the evils prevailing the Philippine society. Rizal emphasized the values of nationalism and love of one's country in his novels. The skating national narrative presented by Rizal served as inspiration for the anti-colonial movement. That is all. Thank you for watching.